What's new on the interwebs, Jason? I want Kofifi. Is that what you're looking up on your phone right now? Is... Yeah, I want Kofifi. I want to know what Kofifi is. Get is off it like your a phone. special type of Colombian coffee or what? No, it's a it's you know that Pokemon combiner? It's a mix between Eevee and coffee. coffee. Yeah, I saw that. <laughs> Kofifi. But I want to know how drunk he was when he sent that out. He probably wasn't even drunk. He was probably tired. He was playing too much golf. What was it like 3 a.m. when he sent that out or something yeah, like that? Yeah, and then like it didn't get put down like until like 3 o'clock. Yay, the flood's back. Oh, yay. yay. I remember these assholes. And Did there's an auto lock feature on this. Great. Is there? Yeah, it kept yay. it kept moving towards all of them below the screen. Hey, you got a checkpoint. Already. And you didn't have to do shit. You ready to die? walk a couple, you know, paces. But yeah. Kofifi. 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 Do you think that's a Baskin Robin flavor? <laughs> it's probably going to be. It at sounds some like point. something Jim Carrey would say. Yeah, kind of. I heard he's getting sued though by his. Uh, I can't remember what. Remember that article I showed you? Like it was, I think it was last week. He's flying. Why is he flying? It's a hologram. Oh, okay. Why are they shooting at him? Because they thought he was real. Oh. Well, no. I'd shoot at a floating person, too. He's using a <laughs> he <must be> so <laughs> what were you saying? He's getting sued by who now? I think it was like his ex-girlfriend's parents or something like that. I don't know. That, well, her His ex-wife died or something, and like she was murdered or some shit like that. And so they're like, I don't know. I don't know. She was died and murdered. She died and murdered. I don't know. She died from murder. Yeah, she died from murder. I don't know what it really was, but I can't remember. Remember, Jason, all you gotta do is hold up a bat and yell, Kofifi! Oh, you have to hold up a bat. Shikaka! Oh, <laughs> okay, this white devil thing's gone far enough. <laughs> Nobody messes with the do! I started, I start, and then uh, he gets his do all fucked up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They give him, like, white devil horns. Yeah. And then he's like, throw me a spear! And just, ah! and like, Throw me a spear again! <laughs> so dumb. Those were See, the, the highlights yeah, of this comedy. The, there's a there's a few Jim Carrey movies I love. That was one of them. Those two movies were like two the, of my favorites. I, fir not, I, I my first favorites. saw the uh, the second one first. Actually. Right, Ace Ventura and uh, Dumb and Dumber made his career. Yes, mm -hmm. Bruce Almighty was funny. He was also really good on In Living Color, that TV show. I don't even know what that is. The Truman Show was really good. The Truman Show was good, and I'm still paranoid to this day because of it. <laughs> it's probably true, just on a larger scale. Right. We're, we're part of well, th show. social media and all that shit. Well, kind of, yeah. I'll hit the floor. Get out of my face. What? Okay. Wow. Bitch. I thought plasma weapons were strong against them. Never mind. They changed it between they games. Nerfed it. They nerfed it. They dude. nerfed it? Yeah, they nerfed it. This is the first nerf ever, guys. <laughs> it's nerf or nothing. Nerf herder. Did you guys ever play nerf like when you were younger? Like with the guns? Yeah. I think I had yeah. a couple. I got. I had a few, but for the most part, no. Not like like these big ass YouTubers that. Uh, yeah, I like how they're actually making uh, like, nerf guns that are meant for adults now. <laughs> like this are size. They? Well, like they have like the sniper rifle one that's like the size of a fucking regular assault rifle. Fuck off. Yeah, I know that, but, like, like, I never got into it. I remember the Super Soakers. That was a shit back then. Uh, for a little while. For but little it was while. a lot like Nerf, where it's like, look, unless you have a lot of friends to hang out and play quote-unquote war games with, it's not really that fun. Yeah, it really wasn't. But the thing with me, the thing in the pain in the ass with me, though, it was, like, reload, like, getting all the fucking, like... <laughs> Guys, I just shot all 50 of my darts. Time Let's out, time looking. out. <laughs> yeah, time out. I'm out of ammo. I mean, yeah, I mean, I don't think kids these days even play with that shit. That's why, like, I think Toys yeah, R Us are going no, out of business. I, I, I see them. I, I, it, it, yeah. They do. Some kids it's have It's just that th it's been we, we grew up with large backyards. Kids and nowadays no, and no technology. Yeah, kids nowadays their yards are like a quarter of the size I grew up with. Yeah, true. But also you have to. Like, I don't know that one house that we were checking out like what a year ago that had a well, huge. Well, but that's backyard. an older house. Yeah, it's an older house. But no, it, I mean like 
technology is caught up, and they, that's the new thing, I well, guess. You know? It's like any generation. New technology creates new things for kids to do. Yeah, but I don't know. Like, I miss those. Me, personally. I miss the days where you could throw a lawn dart in the air. <laughs> 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 what was it called? Um, uh, Arrow Roulette from uh, Grown Ups? Uh, I never saw Grow Ups. Grew ups, grow grown, grown ups, ups whatever. Grew ups. I never, grew ups. I never saw it. I never seen grew ups. What the hell's grew ups? I never seen it. Or grown ups. You're, you're Ow! Grown ups was okay. It was okay, but it wasn't. We good. had this discussion though, with Adam Sandler and his failed career. Lane. See, I missed the Adam Sandler with Billy Madison, Waterboy, with Billy Murray. Billy, Billy Murray. Murray. Oh, but, uh, the enthusiasts. They're funny guys. Are they? Oh, I did not mean to turn invisible. Oh, well, whatever. It works. Really? You couldn't assassinate him while invisible? You, nope, you can't assassinate them. They're flood, Tyler. They're flood. Wait, are the flood in the other games? They are in Halos 1 through 3, Halo Wars. Halo Reach. They are not in Halo Reach. Halo Wars 2. I think they might be. I don't know. I haven't played it. Starcraft. Why not? Ah, uh, it's Aren't not. Aren't you supposed to be a, a Halo enthusiast? I yeah, am. but he's not an RTS player. It's true. I had a hard time beating the first Halo Wars uh, game because I'm just not. Did good you at play those it games. on normal or did you? I played it on normal and I got my ass handed to me, dude. Well, and huh, that's, that's an RTS though. Yep. Because turn-based strategy, first-person shooter, Fuck. is different strategy from real-time battle strategy. Ah. <sighs> You're, you are on Harden, aren't you? I am. Well, it's called Heroic, Harden. but yes. <laughs> you are Harden, aren't you? I am pretty hard right now, yes. <laughs> you're, you're like fucking Metapod and Kakuna right now. <laughs> the, the most epic We're going battle nowhere. Ever. Battle ever, yeah. <laughs> we're not going anywhere. <laughs> Until one of them fucking evolves just right in front of your eyes. And you're like, oh, now I can finally fucking beat do, this do, 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 that's do, why do. I ne I, that's why I never fucking like... That's, that's why you never catch a wild Metapod or a yeah. Kakuna. You always evolve it so it has tackle. Yep. Yep. <laughs> I, I remember, in like, back in the generation. anime when uh, Ash goes to Johto and he goes against that second bug type gym leader. It has the <laughs> Scyther and the Metapod. He's like, it's a Metapod. What's it going to do? And it kicks the shit out of his Syndic will. <laughs> if only the games would allow Harden to increase Metapod's attack with it. Yeah. I remember, like, when I knew nothing about Pokemon and I was looking over the shoulder of one of my friends who was playing it. Um,. And he was in Viridian Forest, and the thing used Hardened, and I thought that he was going to, like, encase his Pokemon into a shell. I was like, <laughs> oh, no, watch out! He hardened himself. Ah, he's an idiot! Why would he harden himself? He's such a dumbass. <laughs> and now I'm just like, oh. Now I see. In, in the later games, didn't they make it so that uh, Metapods and Kakunas could learn Tackle? Um... I'm, I'm not say sure. I, I don't think so. I, I, I mean, I, I've only played past. I didn't even play past the uh, I, I crystal, don't, silver, and gold. That, crystal those myth. Awesome. I don't think. I don't think they did. Okay, I just swear I've heard that. Like, if you caught a wild one, well, like it would probably be at a much higher level than past level ten when they evolve into their. <laughs> I don't want plan. you to evolve so you can learn tackle. Why? Are you stupid? <laughs> it's like that's like holding back your magic carp. Okay, would you rather get a Caterpie or a uh, Weedle? Caterpie. Weedle. Caterpie. Okay, would you rather get a Kakuna or a Metapod? Well, Doesn't this goes matter. down the same line. Oh, yeah. fuck! This goes down the same line. I would rather have it so I can get a Butterfree in the end. Okay, so. If I'm going based off the Pokemon uh, to Pokemon comparison, I would rather have a Weedle. But so would if you I'm rather going have a Butterfree or a we uh, Beedrill? I'd rather have a Butterfree. Okay, yeah. Maybe. Yeah, but I'd a rather Weedle have a is a far stronger Pokemon than a uh, um, Caterpie is. Yeah. I just look at the evolution line. I would rather have the yeah. Caterpie. If so I'm that going I can off get... of ev evolution line, give me Caterpie. If I'm going just case to case, then I would rather have a Weedle. I've actually tried raising a Butterfree to like go up and go to like the Pokemon League. It's I didn't get it to the league because it's fucking difficult, dude. Oh, yeah. yeah. But the, well, status effects were not very strong in the original game. It's not just that. It's just that its defense is... There's no defense. Yeah, that's why... It, it is entirely reliant on status. You yeah. give it sleep powder, and you give it 
uh, confusion, psychic, something of that sort to take advantage of it. And you put them back to sleep when they wake up. I've been telling myself to replay Pokemon Red because I have it on my 3DS. And they actually just announced that they're going to be bringing gold and silver to the virtual console as well. Yay! So I'm going to be getting silver. Absolutely. Wait, what, what about Pokemon Red and Blue on the Oculus? Dude, that'd be fucking awesome. <laughs> You awesome. are red. But we already were red. In life! <laughs> it's in your face. Pokemon will be all up in your face. Um, what was it? Wurmple. Fat Wurmple. Oh, ass. fucking Wurmple. Generation 3 Caterpie, basically. <laughs> it would evolve into two different... Randomly. It was random. It wasn't random, though. It kind of was. Like, it depended on the stats. Yeah. But it's like it, it's not random in that there's a set cause for it. Oh, this but fucker! You have to raise your stats for it. Wait, what did it turn into? It's it either went into Silcoon, which went into but oh, uh, Beautifly. Okay. Yeah, Be Beautifly and Dustox. And Dustox was really the better one, but I just hated it, dude. Fuck well, it's, off. Well, it's like get. Having a Venomoth versus a Butterfree. Venomoth. Venomoth. Venomoth is technically stronger, but a Butterfree has better special abilities. Yeah. I remember... Because Poison is garbage. I'm not sure now if I've told the story about how I left my Pokemon Red game in my dad's house when I was a kid. Have yeah, I talked about you, that? You, you told me this like a billion times. Did he tell you? Did I tell it on the can. channel, though, is what I'm oh, saying. Oh, no, 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 no. So, yeah, like, my dad gave me Pokemon Red. Is that and Half -Life I, gun? a Half-Life gun? I wish. <laughs> oh. But, um... No, he gave me Pokemon Red in a Game Boy Color for Christmas, like, when I was eight. And I went to his house for summer vacation one year, and I left it at his place on accident. I was fucking pissed. But then I went to go visit him a few months later, and he had played it. Like, he had started up his own file and everything. So he had gone all the way to the Pokemon League. I remember I remember only two Pokemon, no, three Pokemon in his team. He had a Zapdos. Holy shit. He had a uh, Beedrill, a level 63 Beedrill. Your dad must have been fucking hella bored. He was fucking bored. <laughs> That's all it was. <laughs> um, and then uh, I remember the Venomoth. He had a Venomoth. And the only reason I remember that is because I had never beaten the Pokemon League before, but I took his team through it just to see what happens. Uh -huh. um, and I remember his Venomoth. I put it up against Lance, the Dragon Trainer, and he has like three Dragonites. And none of his Dragonites would attack the Venomoth. It was the weirdest fucking thing. It was the only reason I was able to beat Lance was because they wouldn't attack my dad's Venomoth. Oh, that's right. Because in the early games, they had it programmed where it would always use a type advantage move. And his Dragonites, if I remember right, knew Reflect, which is a psychic type move. Mm. So no matter what, they're programmed to use a type advantage move like psychic. I have even heard though, of that. Or, or like reflect, even though it does no damage. Oh fuck! Oh, I thought I fell off. Okay. So yeah, it, you can cheese the old uh, games do you still, real do you still, easy. Do you tell your dad like you? I fucking hate you for fucking you know playing my my Pokemon. You erased right? my file. No, I wasn't mad because I I saw how far he went. I was like fuck. My dad's a badass. Yeah, you've done more than I ever did in Pokemon, and now now he doesn't have jack shit on me. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> Come on, Lane. Are that was a one hit. You let him assassinate you. I don't think he assassinated me. I think he just straight up punched me. Like you jumped into his punch. That's how. Like, <laughs> Take me now. <laughs> Fuck, uh, dude. I still, I I still prefer like the original animated series yes versus the new stuff oh god the new stuff is just i don't know pokemon origins was pretty cool origin oh, was fucking good. awesome yeah, yeah it was good that one was good <laughs> but yeah, they really have, did the fans jason justice you have you have to think though that pokemon has not changed at all no it literally has not changed except for the animation in the newest series yeah the the and the voice actor. Apparently, the guy it. who did Origins is doing the animation for that the newest one where he's I in can Hawaii. Live with that, but it's like so. it's the same. Huh. It's the same stories. It's the same lessons. It's the same problems and conflicts and resolutions. Still the same. Him never beating the Pokemon League. Yeah, it, it's all the same across the twenty years it's been on. 
the only thing that's changed is we've grown up and gotten tired of happily ever after stuff. Well, you also have that fucking fan theory. That he's dead? Yeah, that he's like... no, that Or that he's, he's like coma. in a coma. Yeah, there's one where he's in the coma, or there's one where it's because of Ho-Oh that he never ages. Yeah. Do you... Lane, do you remember when you got silver and gold and finally connected? Holy shit, this was in the first episode. Yep. I was like, oh. <laughs> oh my god. Uh. That was a mindfuck when I was a kid. I was like, no. <laughs> I can do that? I remember always thinking, like, uh, I think it was Viridian City. Like, the second city you go to. Uh -huh. Or something like that. The second or third city. That, what there's is a that? Uh, there's a... Misty's? No, 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 that's Cerulean. Yeah, that's the second... No, that's uh, the second the, gem battle. That's the, the second, second gem battle. one is Pewter City. N no, that's like the third or fourth. No. No, because you have Pallet Town, and then you go to Viridian. Oh, you're counting count Pallet Town. Yeah, you always count Pallet Town. Well, no, but I'm saying, like, you were saying second or third that you visit. Oh, okay, cool. As in you were traveling to. Yeah. You got taken wow, down. Lane. Wow. You got taken down by a bitch. My shields were down. I don't care. You let a face hugger touch you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. You think that's what they said in the... Speaking of which, Jason, did you go see the new alien? No, I want to, but someone hasn't seen Prometheus yet. Why? You have gone seen it. You have gone to see plenty of movies that I want to see, <laughs> but you were like, oh, I just want to go see it myself. It was like, whatever. I just want to go see it myself. So why haven't you gone to see this one? Because I'm waiting for you. Then let's watch Prometheus. Okay. Okay. We'll, we'll rent it out. We'll go see it tonight. <laughs> we'll go rent it. So I'm pretty sure you'll go to a drive-in. No, well, no, no. That's I've, actually funny that you. Mentioned have you ever been to a drive-in, Jason? Yes, I have. Have uh, you ever been to a drive-in? Awesome. It's funny that you mentioned that because yesterday I hung out with my cousin and uh, my one of my other friends. Uh huh. And it, my cousin, for some reason, my cousin, like, he doesn't like his girlfriend with curly. He doesn't like girls with curly hair. Like, are you really gonna talk hair. about this shit that he told us in confidence? No, no, we're not. We're not. We're, no, not that part. But no. <laughs> but, but uh, yeah, for some he, reason, it really weirds him out when girls have curly hair. Yeah, and you like mean his, like it's just natural, like natural curly hair. He doesn't like it. He's like, he tells me yesterday, he's all like, "Yeah, my girlfriend." Which I'm crazy for. I love curly hair. And he's all like, uh, he's like, "Yeah, my uh, my girl had uh, curly hair on Tuesday, and she wanted to uh, you know get freaky and whatnot." <laughs> and I saw that she had curly hair. I was like, "Nah, I'm good." You know, really? Like, yeah, that's yep. what I said. I was all like, really? Yep. You know and what, like, Jason? You should get him like one of those shih tzus that just has naturally curly <laughs> hair. <laughs> oh, that, he'd be so pissed. <laughs> but like, anyways, uh, yesterday he's all like, yeah, she wanted to go to the drive-in uh, like, to go watch a movie or something. I'm like, why didn't you go? I'm like, nah, I didn't want to. I'm like, I was watching the game, the, the Cavs vs. the Warriors game. And then I fell asleep. I'm like, oh, okay, cool. And then like we went to uh, like these... Uh, places where you have street racing at uh-huh like me and my uh, me and my uh, cousin and my friend and uh he sees on snapchat that she's straightened out her hair he's like fuck i should have gone and he's like i'm fucking pissed now she always does this like on the weekend she'll straighten her hair but like during the weekdays like nothing i'd do that too and just he's to and piss he's him off and he's told her he's told her straight up to his, her face i hate your curly hair like Point blank, dude. See, see, I'm willing to bet she's doing it despite him. Then that's what I'm thinking she's doing. Cause that—that's what we told him too. Is like, dude, she's just doing it on purpose, then. And she has every right to, cause that's stupid. <laughs> that's what I said, but you know, I don't know. Like, look, I'm very picky look. It's with okay women. to have preferences. I I prefer a girl with long hair, but that doesn't mean grow your hair out or cut your hair. If I prefer short, it means that's my preference. Don't change it if you don't like it, though. Yeah. I don't know. I just find it funny. Oh, yeah. It's hilarious, especially if she is just fucking with Which him. Which reminds me also as well. Oh, my God. I went to... So, I went... Like, my sister wanted to go shopping yesterday, so oh. I took her, right? Oh, oh my God. Wait, she is she shopping with her money or yours? Uh, His. Mine, yeah. <laughs> yeah, sucker. Like, I don't mind buying her stuff, but oh, my God. So she's a pricey little one, though. Yeah. No. Do you have you ever heard of this fucking store called Sephora? Yes. 
Oh I, my fucking Jason, lord. Jason, the only thing I know about that store is the name sounds like it's out of my price range. Oh, it is pro- it's fucking makeup. It's like for women and shit. Oh, and see, one tube of problem. mascara. You, there's your problem. Makeup. Yeah. Makeup one is fucking, fucking expensive. expensive. <laughs> one fucking tube of mascara, probably like this big. Like this big. 24 fucking dollars. For everyone who Fuck can't you. see. It's about three inches. It, uh, roughly like four. Okay? Still. But still, 24 fucking bucks for this thing. I only paid $12 for now it you know because my sister feel. had a fucking gift card for like $12. <laughs> and I was like, you're fucking How did your me. sister get a gift card to Sephora? Uh, I think it was for her birthday. Oh, okay. Some who the fuck thing. gave her a gift card to Sephora? Her friend, I don't know. Okay. The, your mom, I was gonna say like your one of your grandma, uncles or something. your dad. Who? No, but oh my god, dude! And she, I was just like, "Are you fucking kidding me?" And she's like going around the whole store. I'm like, "You know what? Fuck it. Let's get the fuck out of here." <laughs> one fucking chapstick. One chapstick. Normal size chapstick. Seven bucks. Seven can, fucking bucks. But you can grab a twelve pack of that shit for like three. Oh fuck! What'd you do? God damn! I man. I did what Jason did in the first game. Oh, <laughs> achievement. <laughs> <laughs> okay, get you know, out. Here is Zoom. <laughs> but no, like for real, like I was just mind boggled. And then we went to a fucking I don't know if you heard of of, of heard of a store called El Pasto. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh my god. Okay, nothing bad with that store. You know, good. Uh, it's I like if the Peter now. Simon or, it, or Simon Peter. It's the made same thing for clothing though. Yeah, it's the same thing for clothing. I mean, it's it's a it's an okay store. You know, it's just but, ridiculously no, 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 overpriced. No. Here's the fucking thing though. Okay. So I go in, my sister's looking for something, and I'm just, like, hanging around. Like, you know, there's a men's section, so I take a look at it, see if there's anything that piques my interest. And uh-huh. there was one thing, but it was a little out of my price range. I'm like, nah, I'm not uh-huh. going to spend. Okay, anyways, the one of the workers, dude, have you guys ever seen Drake and Josh? Yep. No. You guys remember Drake? Bell yes. In that show? Yeah. He reminded me a lot of him. He comes up to me. You know, wavy hair and all. You know, he's a good-looking guy. You know, he's a little scrawny, but he's good-looking. Okay. And he's like, and he comes up to me, he's like, "Sup, dude?" And I'm like, "Hi." He's like, <laughs> "My name is Stan Smith." And I'm like, "Like from, fit, like from American, American Dad?" Dad? That, that's what I said. I was like, <laughs> "I was like, uh, okay." He's like, "Man, I'm so." You know tired. what you should have said? It's like, man, I thought your chin would be bigger. <laughs> <laughs> but no, it, like I was like, uh-huh. "Fuck you, assholes, dude!" Friendly fire. <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> but anyways, he's like, "Yeah, man, I'm so tired. Like, I don't even know where I'm at right now. Like, this is how he was talking to me. This is an employee. This was an employee. He's like, is he I work like high. <laughs> this is what he said to me. He's like, I'm so tired. I worked like 60 hours this last week, dude. And I'm like, Why are you telling me this? Yeah, I'm like, dude, I worked like 80. <laughs> like, I, I worked like 120." Like, in the last two weeks. Like, I don't want to fucking hear it, you know? And, like... I'm tired just standing here. Yeah. And he's just... He gives me this, this whole backstory. He's like, yeah, man, so are you here to, like, shop for you? And I'm all like... No, my sister's here. He's like, oh, okay, right on, right on. He's talking in this fucking language. I felt stupid just fucking <laughs> talking to this motherfucker. He was at least, like, 18. I want to say 18, okay? He's like... I was like, all right, where do you work? What's your other job? He's like, oh... I I own a kiosk at the, you know the fashion place. Of course mall. you do. Of course you do. And doing and what? Selling make, hemp? Nope. <laughs> he's, like, he's like he's like I make phone cases out of wood, and I'm like, oh, say that one more time. He's like, I <laughs> so make he phone, makes cases phone cases out, of, out of wood, and I'm like, okay, how is that gonna protect your fucking phone? It's wood. Like I would. It looks good, man. It looks good. Yeah. He's like, Do you put like a special gel layer inside the wood? Can you nah. afford that? Look, he's like, he's like, I make, make the signs. A, can you make me a special case that goes over the case that will actually protect my phone? Right. But no, <laughs> this guy. I'm just like, okay, that's not even hard work, dude. Like, you're sitting I, whittling. Yeah, he's like, he's like, I make the signs for phones, dude, and like, okay, that's all cool. wooden. And I'm that's like, cool. That's innovative. He's all like, That's, yeah. It's not necessarily hard work, though. Yeah, exactly. And I'm like. Well, I wouldn't be able to do he's it. He's like, I, I own this kiosk with my friend, dude. We pay like two grand for the t- for the kiosk every month. And sometimes during like holidays, it's like $8,000 for that kiosk. And I'm like. Cool. 
Cool. You Good better to know. Start, you better start selling a lot more. If you know, typically, want customer that. service in customer service, you make the customers start talking, and then you regret it because the customers talking. <laughs> you, you don't talk the customers ear off. That's like, bad customer service. Like, and I, like I said, he was a good-looking kid. I saw that he had like a group of women, like a like a little girl, like. Yeah, some, I also some, play some guitar on the weekends. Okay, like, <laughs> and like they were like staring at like you know he was a good-looking kid. I'm not gonna lie, but. Dude, dumb, dumb as a, a fucking brick. <laughs> I was like, oh my god. Like, I came out of that store feeling stupid, and my sister goes, what do you want? I'm like, I don't know. But I, <laughs> I honestly stupid. don't know. You didn't try to sell me shit. Yeah, Blood exactly. with an energy sword. <laughs> exactly. Blood with an energy sword. <laughs> fuck. <laughs> he doesn't have the energy sword anymore. Uh, well, that's because I killed him. Yeah, but fucking, oh my god. <laughs> this dude, I swear to god, I was like, oh my god. Someone fucking give him a fucking, like, Give him liquor. Give, give him, him coffee. Liquor, yeah, give him something. something. Sober him up. But dude, like he wasn't even high, dude. He was just like. You sure? No, he wasn't high. Are you sure? I know, cause I looked into his eyes, which is I, lo I looked day. into his eyes. <laughs> but like, and I saw. Okay, they, they were clear as fuck. They were as was green he, as the hemp oh, he was, was using. Was he perma fried? Because there is a difference. Uh, yeah, yeah, there kind is. Kind of, we, maybe. We, we know some perma frieds. But like, he, dude, I own a kiosk at the shop. It's called Perma Fried. <laughs> all we do is sell skillets that's all we do <laughs> i carve them from wood and then we also have a little five dollar section of old skillet cds <laughs> like no but for real dude i was just like i've never met a motherfucker like this ever in my life yeah you have have i okay. well, we've no, worked no. with people like this well, okay yes i know that but like who talked like that like dude like do you know the moon is like a crescent shape no, right. motherfucker, it's not. But only, but it's only. It's fucking not, motherfucker. But only sometimes. <laughs> you know, it, like, I felt so fucking stupid. Oh, and I'm I like, did. Shit, fuck. I fucked up. I fucked and up. And then he was telling me, he's like, oh, um, yeah, I, I got like four sisters. No, I actually got four. No, I got four. I got four. And I'm like, which one is it, fucker? Five or four? I'm like, oh, fuck, okay, which one of you has a sword? I need a sword. It, it's, it's like trying to figure out, okay, do I count my half-sister as a sister? Right. <laughs> but, oh, my God. I barely I count my so half-brothers as brothers. Are you kidding me? Stupid. <laughs> like, funny part was um, after, you know, I was done talking to him, I'm like, all right, I got to go. And he goes, oh, yeah, I better I better go, like, see if I could clean something or something. You I'm think? Like, Good cover, bro. You think? You, like, or you could have spent this last ten minutes trying, trying to, to sell, sell me something, something right? Like Come a fucking fuck shirt, on. fucking. He even he, he even asked me. I I forgot about this, but he like there were, we we're like some we're like right next to the like women's section. Uh huh. And there was like you know the the mannequins with like the the clothes on them and all that. Please like, tell me he wasn't trying to feel it up. And he was like, "What do you think of this man?" Like I'm like, "It's a mannequin." It's a mannequin. He's like, "No, I'm talking about the like you know." I think it's the, more the, plastic the shirt, than your mom's tits. The blouse. And the and the and the miniskirt, I like it a lot, dude. It, the, it looks like, okay, but it's on a mannequin. Yeah, exactly. It's like, <laughs> sir, yeah, do you good. are you employed here because you get turned on? I mean, the only time Whee! thinking a mannequin is hot is really appropriate tends to be when you're at that prepubescent kid stage. And even then, it's like <laughs> I dude, thought you were gonna it. say prepubescent kid store for a second. Oh. No. <laughs> well, that's Shut up. like like I was just like, where is he going with this? <laughs> like, okay, you're eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, somewhere in that area. Yeah, yeah, it's like, yeah. You're okay when you're still too embarrassed to walk past the bra section at Walmart with your mom. Oh God! And now it's just like you're marching past. It's like, yep, this is on the way to electronics. All yeah. right, all right, come on, it's I need just there. new iPod. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> it's just Do there. Do people even fucking cares? use iPods anymore, or are they just everyone uh, uses their phone now? I think everyone. Well, Tyler uses. His I iPod. use I still, an iPod. I, I use my iPod too. I mean, like. Well, I, but I generally listen for longer periods of time than my phone can handle. Okay, true. Yeah, exactly. And see, I'm even thinking about getting a music device. That way I can just use that purely for music. Yes, get a Zoom. Get a Zoom. Get a Zoom? Yes. Yeah. Why? I've heard they're great. Yes. They're the shit now. But didn't they die, though? Yeah, they did. <laughs> <laughs> see, it's too bad Guardians came out this late. It could have helped Zoom sales. It could have, <laughs> right? It's on a Zoom. And hey, wait. Bill, will you help me program my Zoom? <laughs> Oh, wait, I have an iPod like everyone else. <laughs> You're a jerk. 
Yeah, looking back at now, dude, like the first iPods were so bulky and shit. I loved my iPod Classic though. Yeah, I mean they're they're the they're... fucking scroll wheel. Yeah. <laughs> I had an iPod Shuffle. That was that was kind of fun for a while. I had. I, let's see. I had the iPod Shuffle. I have a iPod Touch now. Did you ever have the Nano? I still have my first generate the first generation iPod Touch because I take care of my shit. Did Did you ever get a Nano? Yes, I had a Nano with the screen on it. The one where well, that's what I meant. I had a I had a Nano. That's what I had. It's the only a screen. Yeah, and those ones are all right. I mean, they're more for like workouts. Like if you're gonna go on a workout, they hold songs. Yeah, just clip it on. Oh, they hold songs. If you if you think an iPod is fragile, heaven forbid you drop a Nano. Yes, because that is all screen. That's like dropping your iPhone. It will crack no matter you what. You want to know what I also remember? I remember... Do you guys remember the Psychic phones? The Psychic? Yes. Motorola? The, with the... No. Uh, like with the keyboard? Yeah, like, with the keyboard. The one where the fucking... Uh, it looked like a fucking, like, a PSP, but then you flip the fucking... Uh, the screen, oh. And it's like a, yeah. like a keyboard. I, I don't Didn't know Tony why, I've always Iron Man wanted movie? that shit. What? Didn't Tony Stark have that in the Iron Man movie? The I first don't one? remember. It was around that era too. It was around that time where 2008, they were, 2009, yeah, yeah right was, before smartphones really hit over. off. Yeah, but I've always wanted. Dude, I remember my friend. His name was Anderson uh, Cooper. Cooper. No, really? <laughs> what the fuck is this fucking Mary Kate and Ashley bullshit right here? <laughs> We've lived with each other for three years. <laughs> like seriously, <What>? fucking <laughs> shit. Anyways, his name was Anderson Tran. Okay. Okay. And it, Anderson was, Cooper Tran, got yeah. it. And he got the brand new a sidekick, dude. And I guess he was like in a bad relationship or something like that. And he but but his girlfriend it. broke up with him or something. And like we were like this is after school, and like he chucked his phone like a hundred feet, like not even a hundred feet, but he chucked it in the air. And my friend Albert, dude, I'm not fucking kidding. This dude saw him like about to chuck it. Uh -huh. He ran. A good fucking like hundred feet just to catch it, and this fucker dove for it and <laughs> saved this fucking thing from hitting the concrete. I was just too busy laughing my ass off seeing Albert trying to. Well, but the catch thing is, shit. those old like flip phones and shit. Those things were near indestructible as long as they weren't flipped out. Yeah, yeah, and like, I, I, you, the iPhones of like two thousand to like two thousand. No, let's say two thousand three to two thousand like nine. Before iPhones? they became all screen. Yeah, it was the Razer. You guys remember that shit? Oh yeah. Those I had like. Those were popular, dude. Those were, and I liked it. They, they were sleek. They were, they were, they were cool. What age did you get your first cell phone? Thir uh, Thirteen. Seventeen. Thirteen. My first pay phone was a Virgin Mobile. Same. Pay as you go. Same, Same here. Virgin Mobile. It was a little uh, flip phone. <laughs> um, and I loved that thing. First right. minute like, is I $2. still have it. I still have mine. Actually. I, I, I went through like some of the rubbish I had in a garage the other day, and I ha I saw that my I, my dad has still has his fucking Nokia. Wow, ah, his nice. brick one. And I'm like, that's yeah. awesome. He I remember my mom used to have one, and our dog gave money, it. right? And I was like, huh, like this shit's still not damaged. Okay, what happened to the energy sword? You know, killing things, ever? They nerfed it, dude. I'm telling you. Unless it's in multiplayer, it doesn't count. It's stupid. I don't know about that. Holy shit. Uh, this is see, like that. Days. Like that. Jason, you know, do you ever now... remember pulling out your flip phone and twirling it around like those fucking switch knives? No, I don't remember that. You never did that? You're pulling out our what? Inf what? Like... You know those switch knives where you just... Oh, yeah. oh like where you flip the... The, butter the butterfly knives. Yeah, yeah. the butterfly yeah, yeah. knives. Yeah, you ever do that with your razor or your flip phones? Yeah, but oh, yeah. All the time. I was I was too scared that I might fucking do it so hard that I'll crack the screen or something like that. <laughs> end so up I stopped. throwing the phone. Yeah, I end up throwing the phone or something, so I stop. But yeah, I remember those. Like it's so funny, like the other day my sister I can't remember what, but she got in trouble and my parents took away her phone. She fucking lost it. I'm not fucking kidding you, dude. She was I believe it. Well, it would have been the baby. equivalent of us, like, losing our 64 or our PlayStation. Well, yeah, or the but I'm original just like, Xbox. She's like, I need my phone. I'm it's, like, no, you don't. It's what we lived on after they came out. Exactly, you know. Does and she I, not watch Gabriel Iglesias' movie? No, she doesn't really. I mean, she. She's too young weird. to really appreciate My, my sister's comedy. weird. Well, I'm just saying, like, she was using the same excuse as his son was. Yeah, exactly. 
And that's the first thing that popped in my mind too. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I was just like, Does no, this... you don't. Okay. Like... I understand you think you do, but you don't. Yeah, I don't know. Like today's kids, generation now, are just like so heavily. Well, I can understand too because it would be fucking hard without my phone now. Well, yeah, I you understand that. You just adjust to it. I, I, like, Hell, I, I use my phone for work even. I don't. I mean, don't get me wrong. But like, I'm getting sick of getting clotheslined by these motherfuckers. You don't I know really how many am. times I see her on fucking Snapchat in a day, dude. Like, she's always either on Snapchat or <laughs> that's fucking the one Facebook. Thing I, it's that's like, the one oh thing I don't God. understand about the new generation is why you have to feel like you have to Post share everything every time. The comedian Bo Burnham had an interesting theory for that huh. in his last special. It was like, and I'm just kind of paraphrasing what he Bo said. Bo Jackson? Bo Burnham? Bo Jackson. And um, was that the horse show on Netflix? No, that's, <laughs> that's a football player. Whatever. Anyway, so basically, like, his general idea was that we grew up with the idea of everyone telling us we can do whatever we want to be and that, uh, like, you know, and, like, we, we, could live up, we could live up to our dreams and so many of us didn't do that. And so we flocked to people who did become successful, or like performers or whatever. We flocked to them because we feel like, oh, okay, you did make it. And then we get things like social media that allow us to basically perform for everyone constantly 24 hours a day and everyone performs for us we see each other's lives constantly so it's basically this idea of if i don't perform i'm nothing it's just kind of kind of that idea and see that's what i don't get either too like who gives a fuck like live your life like I, if you want to fucking be a stripper your whole life go for it i'll, I'll, I'll encourage you to do that you know but if you want to do whatever you want to as long some as some people you're are exhibitionists other people you got you just got to believe some people like math and want to be math teachers i went to school with people like that they were good friends of mine yeah, some people want to be artists some people some people like their job running the garbage truck some people like it yeah you know just there's some whatever. people who just like being you. in food you service know, you don't have to feel just because you're, you know, friends might see you a different way doesn't mean it's going to be the end of the world. Yeah, I mean, they're doing better. They might be doing better than you, but, like, uh, But we can say that as who we are now. Because when you were in junior high, yeah, high... It was all about the status. Yeah, and that's what it is for them. And that's, yeah, this social media kind of... Um, what's the word I'm looking for? It, it, it just kind of... Brainwashed? No, no it's it kind of... It exacerbates it. Yeah, it's yeah. created inferiority complexes because well such and such friend has 500 followers while i only have 50 that doesn't mean you're less popular less cool less whatever what an, yeah. it just means that more people have seen their stuff damn it i lost him i lost which one was him but i don't know i guess it's just one of those things kind of sad though but we all had that too Whoever had the Nintendo or the PlayStation was the cool kid. Kind of. Oh, you know it was. Did I not get The coolest him? kid was the one that uh, had the Super Smash Bros. Or the kid who had the largest Pokemon card collection. Yes. And then got it stolen at school and got it all banned. Yes. Fucker. Now, even even now, like I feel like kids don't even watch TV as much as oh, I used no. to. At least. Fuck no. YouTube, Why the Netflix, fuck would I watch TV when Hulu. there's YouTube, Netflix, Hulu, Redbox, go into an actual theater? I mean, fuck, there's so much live streaming shit out there for like Twitch and all that that there's no point in watching TV. True, but like... I guess back then we didn't have that shit. Either. No. Back then it was like, okay, who has a dish? You're cool. <laughs> right. Who has the premium cable package? You're cool. What do you mean checkpoint? That should just be the end of the level. Now it's just who... Now that isn't a, a level. Really? Before. That should be the end of the level. You didn't kill everyone. You didn't kill him, yeah. I killed the guy. No, you didn't. He went away. What is this bullshit? E3 tomorrow, I forgot. Yep. Well, technically, it already started. What are you looking forward to, Jason? I want to just see the new trailer for the fucking Modern War... Uh, sorry, not Modern War, for the World at War 2. World War 2? World War 2. The World at War game? Yeah. So are you interested in them bringing back clans for online? 
You know, I was actually thinking about that. I was I was playing uh, online uh, Modern Warfare Remastered the other night, uh-huh. and I was like, "Whatever happened to clans?" Like that well, shit was like it stopped being a team game and started being a showboat game. True. I mean, how often do you see groups of people partying anymore when you play online? Not that many. Yeah, at it's all. not often. It'd be nice if I could even see where I was getting shot at. Fucking assholes. But yeah, from what I've... What little I've heard, it sounds like they're going the battlefield route. Like where they have giant open field battles where it's squad-based. So that might be cool, especially if you can get like 10 friends to play with you at the same time. True. Very true. And Jason knows enough people everywhere so he can easily get 10 people. Well, it's true. Finally! Oh, fuck you, teabag. Teabag, fuck you. See what happens when you stop using needlers? I wasn't ever using needlers! <laughs> Go fuck yourself! <laughs> End of the level! Are you sure? Yes! Unless they did some more nerf, according to Jason. Nerf! Doof. The guilty spark revives him. I don't know if you remember, but he was supposed to be gone at the end of the first game. Was he? Yeah, he was supposed to die. So it's supposed to be this whole thing that he's back. Ah, uh, fuck you, Tartarus. Okay, end level. Took right, me well, an hour and a half to fucking do that shit. Loser. Wait, we're on Legendary? Oh, no, Heroic. Okay. All right, we'll see you guys next time. I got this. See you in a bit. Bye. Hey, if you like this video, please like, subscribe, and show your enthusiasm in the comments below. And if you want more, then please check out this cute little girl as she destroys this chicken monster.